Picking up our car from the service. Oh, so much stuff. <laughs> We're gonna, don't mind that. Cool, so we just picked up our car from a very overdue service. Um, we've been putting it off for the last, like, should I dare say, like six months? Is it six months? I reckon it has. Last time we were flying somewhere, I can't remember, but we were like, every time we're like, oh, we should service the car. Anyway, so we went to um, Alfred's um, mate's mechanic, Dazza. So thanks for hooking us up. Thanks, Dazza. Welcome to today's vlog, guys. Um, if you noticed, I have dark hair now. <laughs> um, I did a video on my main channel showing you my, I guess, hair transformation going from pink to something much more natural and low maintenance. So, if you haven't watched it already, head over um, to... <laughs> oh my god, you almost killed us. That was the tightest turn ever. Are you crazy? It's a narrow road. It what was can I so do? Oh my god. Okay, so Alfred just turned and he pulled like... it's The road's so narrow that I felt like the car was going to flip. Anyways, where was I? I just totally lost my train of thought. Thank you. So I changed my hair. Today, we are heading into the city to the office. We're going to go see the girls at Pop Sugar. I'm sure you guys have heard of Pop Sugar. You know, you see them all over um, Facebook videos as well as on their website. So I'm doing a Facebook Live with the girls at Pop Sugar. We're trying weird face masks. Something that's right up my alley. Why do people say that right up my alley? That's a good one. That's a good, I don't know. But I just said it because it sounds like, I don't know. Anyway, so right now we're looking for parking around Asheville because we're going to catch a train up to the city because we're going to save a bit of money on parking because parking can be really expensive. I did mention that in my last video, didn't I? Well, the other video. One of the videos. Speaking of which, we need to fill up petrol. Oh yeah, you did mention that. I, I told you last night that we need to fill our petrol and you're like, it's fine. no, we still have lots of petrol. It's like almost on empty, the red light's gonna come on and I get really anxious when that happens. Like, I'm one of those drivers that if my petrol is like quarter way, I'm like, oh, crap, need to find a petrol station. I need to fill up. Alfred is like, I'm he doesn't even hand. notice. He actually doesn't even no. notice the level of the I petrol. I noticed once the car starts beeping and saying there's low fuel, I'll drive it for another half a day before I fill up. How dangerous is that? That's it's my worst nightmare. Oh. Like, what if it just like runs out of petrol and then we're stranded somewhere so, in the middle of nowhere? So from my experience, when it beeps and it says it's empty, it's not actually empty. It actually has a little bit of buffer. So half a day is my buffer. So, okay, when I drive, I never let it get to that, that point that the red light comes on. I probably never saw the red light in my car until Alfred started driving it, so that's how bad he is. Uh, comment below if you're like me or comment below if you're like Alfred. Have we ever stored the car because we have no fuel yet? Have we? No, but it makes me like really like nervous, okay? Anyways, wish us luck. We need to find parking. Yeah, we got a car park. The parking got smart upon us. Yeah. Now we just gotta wait for her to leave. We literally circled this car park. There's not a lot of spots. I don't know, we circled how many times at least? Like four or five times. We're just like stalking this lady. And it worked. I'm sorry guys, we just have to vlog like this. This is the problem with Alfred and I. When we stand, I either have to hold the camera up here and then you only see a floating head, or if we're down here, you see no head. I'm sure people don't want to see me anyway. We just finished eating, we had dumplings. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> <laughs> dumplings. Dumplings. <laughs> And now we're at the station, we're gonna get a train up into the city. It's a shame that public transport here is still pretty behind compared to places like Japan, Korea, yeah. Singapore. Yeah. Trains don't come like every five minutes. Yeah. Our train's coming in 11 15. minutes. Is it 11 minutes or 15 now? Oh, you're right, 11. 11. Time to head into the Pop Sugar office and start filming. Are you fixing my hair? Yeah, your back of your head looks fine. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. He's always on hair duty. Yeah, we're going to film a Facebook Live now.
I'm done with the Facebook live. We've caught the train back to get our car and guess what? The light has come up and we are almost empty. What do you have to say for yourself? By almost, you mean we have another half day's ride left? No, no, we need to fill up like ASAP. ASAP! I don't think we do. Did you hear that? This makes me so worried. Like we're stuck in traffic now. It's peak hour. What if we run out of petrol? It's raining. <laughs> You're so triggered. I am not gonna push this car. You won't. Where is the nearest petrol station? This is around the corner. Okay. But if it's more than a dollar twenty, I ain't paying. Now we're talking about petrol prices. We need to fill up. If it's a dollar twenty, we just have to fill up. All right. Okay. Seriously, he thinks it's like this is a serious matter to me. Like I hate this. I hate, I hate well, that's a strong word, yeah. <laughs> well, it is. <laughs> I just like having low petrol and seeing the light come up. I reckon he does this on purpose to just like trigger me. I do actually. Uh, did you jinx the price of petrol? It's like a dollar thirty for diesel, dollar forty-two. Oh my god, it's daylight robbery. See what you did. If we filled up way before, today is like Friday, so petrol prices are up. Are you the diesel price expert? Yes. Do you want anything? Can you buy me a lolly? No lollies? Yes. Water? Yes. Okay. Actually, no, we'll just go home and drink water, save money. We have no water at home. Okay, fine. Out of both of us, I feel like I'm the really frugal one. Alfred's more of like that free spender, and I'm just like, is it on special? Is it on sale? Can we get it anywhere else for cheaper? Especially when it comes to fruit. I like always know the prices of fruit, especially bananas, grapes, and apples. Oh, he bought something. He bought something. It looks pretty big. What did you get? This was a buy one, get one free. So I was like, why not? Wait, how much was one? I don't even check it. I don't even know. But it but could have been like $5 for he one. He said it was the same price as the other bottle of water, which I first grabbed. Okay, cool. It's pink too. How much? <gasps> Maltesers. Okay, How much was that? Was it on special? No, no. Like $8. That, oh, that's so expensive. Eight dollars for this. Okay. It is a family pack, though. I have to get this. <laughs> I have to get another one. <laughs> why? Can you tell everyone why? Because okay. you like. Okay, Alfred loves to read Cosmo. Is that is that the that's secret? Exactly right now, but this is a special one because this is the edition where Tina's on. Ta-da! That is me. Look at my cheesy smile. That's your girl. Do you remember that vlog? Yeah, I was standing on literally like, was it two boxes? I think it was probably like two boxes or a box <laughs> in my, my heeled boots. So Tessie and Tina were on boxes. Right, like, Tara was, was yeah. on, in heels and Elle was just barefoot. She was so tall. I know. Good times. Good memory. So that, yeah. that's like... This is like my, my big feature. I've never been that that big on a centerfold, so it's been really cool. So we gotta frame that, right? How much was petrol? Well, all up it was like 90 bucks. 90 bucks. Mm. <laughs> so You're okay. not very happy. I was just telling them that out of both of us, I'm probably more of a tight ass oh, than yeah. you. And I'm the accountant. Yeah, he's the accountant, but I'm like, oh, we should like eat out less. And we, we should find it when it's on special. And how much are bananas today? Oh, no, we can't get them. I was telling him. Yeah. I'm really good at like remembering prices of Did fruit. Did you just tell him that you ha you are like the banana exchange? Yes. Yeah, so like in a currency exchange, maybe the Alfred, that's more Alfred stuff. Banana exchange, fruit exchange, <laughs> and that is my territory. Mm-hmm. Because mm -hmm. I'm like, no, grapes are really expensive today. We're not having any of them. Bananas are expensive and cold, we're gonna go Woolies. Yeah. If you're like me and you guys like bargains, comment below because this is a normal thing, you know, this is like, this is good stuff. You know, you're lucky I'm not a princess and just like, just a big spender or else you would be broke. No, it's good. I prefer that you being that way. It's a Friday night, we have nothing to do. So, I came up with an excellent idea. Would you like to tell them? We're gonna go pick up Coco. Coco! We have not seen Coco in ages. So we're gonna go to my mum's house and pick her up. Look who it is! Aren't you so excited? Coco. Uh, wrong way, Coco. We don't live down there. Yes, good girl. Oh, you need a shower, you stink. Look at that butt. Look at that butt. Twerk it, twerk it. 
Hey, Coco. Hey. Good girl. You want to go for a walk, don't you? Got to get your leash on. Sit. Let's see if I could do this like one-handed. Put this on your head, Coco. Come on. She's like, what are you doing, mommy? Give me your foot. Put it through. Yes, one foot is in. This one's the tricky one because she doesn't have this back leg. And then we're going to click this baby in. I can't do anything with these nails. Okay, totally needed two hands for that, but I think Coco is ready. We're catching up with our friends today. So Coco gets to come too because we're going to a cafe that has outdoor seating. Just me here. Okay. Where are you taking me? Wrong way, Coco. Wrong way. Come up. Up, 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 up. This way. This way. We're going this way. Come on, let's go. She's waiting for you. Oh, sorry. This is the place we're going to. What up, where's Chelsea? Not here. Busy, busy. We are back home now. I totally forgot to vlog after lunch, but we didn't really do anything interesting. We just sold our dining table because I actually haven't told you guys yet, but we are moving. So we're selling a bunch of our furniture online on Gumtree. So a couple came, they picked up our table. So now that all that's done, it's dinner time. Actually, it's quite late. It's like 9.30. Alpha and I always have a late dinner and you can just like here. Here, Coco's stalking us. Yeah, we always have a late dinner. We spent like most of the evening just packing, packing, packing everything into boxes. Yeah, moving is just so crazy, it's so intense. Not fun. But we ordered pizza. We're gonna have a pizza and movie night. On tonight's menu is a lovely margarita pizza. We got some salad. And there is a pasta, Papa Del Lamb Ragu. Problem now is we don't have a dining table to sit on, so I guess we'll stand and eat. How is it? It's spicy. Did you put chili on it? I thought it's so spicy. <laughs> I put chili flakes on it. How much did we put in it? Well, there wasn't a lot left, so I just like went, went a bit crazy with it. I love chili. So, anyways, why we're selling our furniture is because the new place we're moving to is much smaller. We're downsizing, so um, all this furniture we thought you know we'll kind of just sell off and then get smaller furniture for the new place. Now where are we moving to? You guys will see. I'm pretty excited to show you guys the new place. It's gonna be a big, big change for us. Stay tuned for the next few vlogs until we move and I'll reveal it to you guys because it's pretty exciting stuff. So I'm gonna cap the vlog off there. Are we ready to do our outro? The flying fist. What flying fist? I'll fly fist to like... Are you gonna do that? But then if I touch it, I might like knock it over. Okay, we just, are you ready for it? Okay, I'm ready this time. Okay. Here we go. Anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed today's vlog. Make sure you subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And... We'll speak to you next time. No, no, you didn't even do anything cool. What's, what's the cool I thing? thought you were going to go like, and do like an explosion sound or something. I'd do the pie bro fist. Oh.